Hello, it is your host Ratius, and we're back with Sarah is missing. And apparently, I looked, and apparently, you have to click on her 43rd birthday, which is weird because you can't just enter the lock code. It's kind of messed up, but okay. So, what we got? Get the camera. What we got here? There's a strange photo in the gallery. Take a closer look at it. Strange photo. Uh, she's Instagramming her food. Food, food, food. <laughs> that kind of looks weird. What's on the screen there? That's that's creepy right there. I guess that's nothing. Once you zoom up. Like I say, is it the same picture over and over again? <gasps> Creepy! She doesn't wash her feet! No, I'm joking. Yep, that's me. Uh, lounging, playing games. That's not me with that beat up PS2. Oh god, that looks horrible. And looks like Naruto out of its case. God. The cat's licking his balls! No joke. Hey, there's her lock screen picture. I don't see anything... ...out of the ordinary. At least I'm hoping I don't. Um, what? Seems that this photo correlates with a video and a message thread that Sarah has recently deleted. Would you like me to retrieve the data? Yes. Please wait a moment while I restore the data for you. Thank you. I suggest we restored the message thread between Sarah and one of her contacts, James. That's kind of creepy in its own right, too. And somebody's... <laughs> somebody's... filming her while she's sleeping? That's kind of creepy. That's the pissed off cat! Stop zooming in the cat's balls. What the hell? You sick freak. Gross. Hey look, there's the phone I have right now. There's your phone. So, the question remains, are ghosts still relevant in today's society? Well, I think we all know that ghost stories sort of started out with cavemen sitting around a fire, a campfire, telling each other these stories to scare each other, right? And then yeah, it sure. evolved into um, superstition, there was religion, mm. the 19th century came around, and then of course, um, the advent of vampires. Vampires. But vampires reside in the <laughs> night. So how is it that till today, we still have ghosts, and now ghosts have actually over into cyberspace. Cyberspace. Cyberspace ghost? That's different. Oh shit, there's a ghost behind you! There's a fuck ghost behind you! Oh shit. Oh. No, it's just a friend. That's you. Wait. What is that in the background right there? And click on. Damn it! 
No, there's nothing. Maybe it's your coat or something. Just paranoid. Mm. Messages 88? Mm. Holy shit. What was I supposed to? Mm. New messages. Hey, come on, Sarah. It'll be awesome. No, it won't. Yes, Will, don't make me put a spell on your skinny ass. <laughs> what are you afraid of? I'm not afraid of anything, especially your fake witchery. Lies, you're the most chicken shit out of all of us, and there's nothing fake about my magic. Magic? Witchery? Ass? No? Okay. Yes, it is. You're scared of practically everything. Well, I'm not scared of a fucking party. Fucking? <laughs> Maybe, maybe not, but you're scared of boys. Not sure how Derek is standing you for so long. Hey, you didn't have to say that. Sorry, sorry, is it still too soon? It's about time you moved on. How long has it been? Three months? Two months and 16 days. Jesus, snap out of it, Sarah. Come on, let's go. We'll have some fun tonight, promise? No, I don't know. Let's just check it out. Half an hour, fit sucks with Bill, okay, babe? I don't trust your half hours. Put an alarm, okay? Ha ha. You'll just rot and become like your mom if you stay at home. Sigh. That sells it. I'm picking you up. Be ready by eight. No, no. It's okay. I'll get there myself. I'll see you there around nine. Need to have dinner first. Oh, the witch is cooking? Yeah. Well, on the bright side, if she finally poisons you, <laughs> you don't have to come. Or if you don't come, I'll assume you're dead from poison. And I'll call the cops. All right, all right. I'll come. What are you wearing? Haha. Uh -huh. Can't tell you what I'm not wearing. Slut, bimbo slut, fat cow, <laughs> skinny pimple booker lace vagina. Oh god, and I'm out. See you later. Don't forget to bring those penis socks you got from Thailand. Hey, where are you? Why aren't you picking up? I've been calling for 50 minutes. Faith, if you don't pick up, I'm leaving. You and your late ass. Where's the party? There's no one here. Faith, this is not funny. I'm in the middle of the jungle and I'm alone. Where the fuck are you? Okay, that raised the hairs over my body. No, and Iris is completely okay with me, like, listening to that. Look at that. Oh, I'm supposed to talk to James. Yo, what you up to? Busy, busy. Anyway, I remember you told me you wanted to start a blog tonight about our ghost and curse research. I got something for you if you're interested. Hey, Jim. Yeah, I am. Better be good. Kind of, there's this thing called the Red Room. I've been reports of people dying through weird circumstances. Like, after checking out the weird website, you answer some stuff and then BAM! Okay, keep going. So yeah, they say that if you visit the site, your computer or phone or whatever will start freaking out. Pop-up will start to appear and the visitor will go insane. Hang on, let me find the link to the vid. Okay... <laughs> Yeah, that's not creepy. And apparently my phone is flipping out now. This is not good. Ah, uh, what is this? 90s? Sounds pretty lame. Lame, but get the... What the fuck? Are you okay? My controls are malfunctioning. I can't seem to... It... That the red room congested with, oh, connected with the cult. What cult? The cult is connected. Iris, you're losing me. Found another message that was recently deleted. Might hold some clues I was able to restore. Would you kindly look at it under the Irizu text thread? 
Hello there, is this Sarah? I am Rizu. I received your contact from Faith. She told me you were coming from a, a little party, a special gathering. Hey, Rizu. Yeah, I'm supposed to meet her here. What's going on? I apologize, but reception here is undesirably terrible. And besides, we have a rule. No mobile phones allowed. I'm here to escort you safely to the venue. Escort? Yes, my dear. It's hard to navigate in the dark. Alone, it is a part of our experience. I'm not sure about this. Can I talk to Faith? No, you may not. I apologize, but like I said, phones are not allowed. She is safe there. Probably drunk already. Drunk? Faith doesn't get drunk. How do I know you're really her friend? I have known her since high school. Really? I don't think she's ever mentioned you. I keep a low profile. I'm not sure about this. I think I'll leave. Leave? Sure, you jest. Why? I am almost there. Faith will be disappointed that you didn't show up. She has made reservations for you. Almost where? To where you are, of course. How do you know where I am? Faith told me sh she was meeting you there. I prefer if you didn't come here, please. I'm almost there. Please stop wherever you are. Do not worry, you are safe. I'm going to ring you. Please pick up. Um. Rizu? Sarah? Yeah? Sarah, where are you? I'm not here. Can, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Sarah, I'm at the cult site, Sarah. You gonna text me? What the fuck? Hmm. Hmm. They say, "Why aren't you speaking? I need to talk to you." It's urgent. Where are you? You've been missing from us today. Did you go to that party? Please tell me you didn't. It's real bad news. Party? Oh, he's available. What's going on? If only I can show you the madness. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Tell me what's wrong with the party. Hey, check this out. As those who are trying to prepare themselves for entry into... Hey James, what does this mean? What do you mean? Didn't you get the email I sent you yesterday? By the way, I'm here. Where the party is supposed to be. Oh shit, I see them. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. I don't believe this god. Uh... What, what do you see? Oh fuck, I think they saw me. Who? Um, oh shit, yeah, he wasn't answering. No, they didn't. Jesus, that was fucking close. I'm hiding behind this. I don't know what this is. Fuck, I hear a sound. Uh, he's 
typing. It's typing. Am I supposed to wait? No? I don't know. Oh, there's James. Hey, scary Sarah. Thought this might interest you. Bunch of material for your research. By the way, check out their calendar. Maybe you should stay in tonight. Anyway, let me know what you think. Symbols. Mm. Satanic calendar, mm. what the fuck? Weird. Mm. Mm. He didn't message me. Mm. He stopped messaging me. I don't know if that's good or not. James, are you okay? H hello, hello there. James, is that you? You are not Sarah. But you pretend to be. Oh god. Why? I don't know, just felt right? Interesting. Explain. <laughs> Many choices do not matter. Not as much as we think anyway. But this next choice you may make. Make. You make may? What the? What? James, stop fucking around! <laughs> Oh shit. What's going on? Hey. Try to sync with another. Anyone. Everyone. Let's say goodbye to a brief acquaintance. You have two minutes. Is that what I'm supposed to? Is that what I'm supposed to share? What is he doing? What the fuck is he doing? What is this? Please, whoever you are, do not do this. Don't share the link. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to share the link? He's gonna die, though. He's gonna die. How, how would they know if I shared it or not, though? Am I supposed to share it? Mom? Oh, I don't want to share that to my mom. She'll freak out. Mom? No, I don't. I don't want to send that. So I have two minutes. Two minutes have passed. Oh shit, they killed him, didn't they? I never think that people die. They just go to the departmental store? What the fuck? Well, apparently I succeeded. It's offline. 
the hell? Apparently he's dead. Holy shit. Hello there. It's me again. I apologize for not introducing myself. How rude of me. You sick bastard. You sick fucking bastard. And almost like love dying without apparent pain. Wondering as the world goes by with curls. Smiled if anyone else saw or sent my crime. My name is Arizu. I am one of the, how do you say, leaders for tonight's ceremony. We have met on a very fortunate night. Cherish this moment, my stranger, f my stranger friend. Are you fucking crazy? You just killed someone. Me? Kill. Never. Do not take me as a lowly murderer. Please do not misunderstand my intentions. Uh, yeah, you murdered him. I saw you put the burlap sap on his head, and you murdered him somehow. It's not. You, you murdered him. Why did why kill that poor man? As I said before, I do not kill. I mean, and that poor man was anything but poor. He was the deceiver. No, you killed him. All these choices, what do these options mean to you? Is this your demonstration of free will? Can't you see I'm being forced? That doesn't mean that you should die. Many have died for less. What are you talking about? Where are my manners? I have told you my name, but not what I do. I fear that my age has somewhat dulled me to these simple talk. Small talk, as you call it. It does not matter much what I do, but what's important for you to know, my young friend, is that you, like everything else in this world, you have a choice. I'm here to offer you that choice. You didn't offer James much of a choice. <laughs> Trust me, he had made his choices long ago. Time is of the essence, not reason. Fine, what are my options? <laughs> ah, now you understand. You must ask the right questions. The choice is simple, yet not. Just tell me! <laughs> Would you like to join us? No, no, I don't want to join you. I believe you have the potential. It is rare for me to offer this to someone who is uninitiated. Yes, no, simply, yet not. Uh, no? What if life itself was in the balance? Say, these two young ravishing women. What? <laughs> Well, apparently we find Sarah. She's one of these two. I think it's the one on the left. Mm. You choose between them. Who lives to see the sunrise tomorrow? Mm. Uh, mm. what? Mm. Iris, I need your help. I found her. Found her. Call the cops. Call mm. the cops. Why does it seem like? I was gonna say, why does it seem like he's still online? What the hell? You maniac! You said you do not kill. But I do not. It's not my choice. Sacrifice is not the act of pure destruction. It is merely a transformation. Life is perpetual. Leave it up to you. God himself makes these decisions all the time, does he not? Why not ease some of the work for him, or her, or it, however it is that you see your God, Sarah Faith. Their names mean nothing to you, but to us, they are what binds them to their flesh and mud. Say one of their names, and know that it will be their last breath. 
There is no sweeter invite than a last breath to welcome you. One passes, another comes. What say you? Uh, mm. neither one? Mm. Life's in danger. Do whatever it takes to save her. Mm. Yeah, but you won't be online mm. to... That's very suspicious. Mm. This is frickin' stupid! Everything in life is a choice. Whether you join us or not. It makes no difference. Yes. No. Sarah, wait. You have ten seconds. And what happens if I wait ten seconds? One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand. I didn't say anything. I didn't even say faith. That's bull. That is bullshit. You chose for me. No, I didn't even say anything. That's bullshit. Um, no, I didn't kill anybody because I didn't say that. Bullshit. Now you gotta help, Iris? What the hell? Sorry, I don't think I can help you this time. Why not? Maybe I should rephrase that. I don't think I want to help you this time. Why are you talking like this? I'm appalled by your indecision. Okay. It is obvious who you should choose. How is it obvious? Spell it out. This phone belongs to Sarah. Yeah, therefore, I am loyal to Sarah. Therefore, faith must die. I voluntarily decided to take away your freedom of choice, your free will, if I may so. So you did it, you bitch! Your indecisiveness would have caused harm to Sarah. That is unforgivable. Wow. That reminds me of, like, how movie how back in the day it's kind of creepy I'm guessing that's it though we made it this far too bad you won't make it much further but know that you have now become part of something much larger all group you build in due time but not this instant any last words as you humans are so fond of leaving words behind. I'm awestruck. Oh wow, oh wow, oh wow. It's not that I don't love our little chats, it's just... I don't love them. guess that was it. Sarah is missing. There you have it. Uh, I guess the phone decided to save Sarah all on its own and blame it on me. Hope you enjoyed this video. Kind of freaky. Till next time. Take care.